Hello guys, today our topic is um, uh, finding polynomial and uh, finding missing terms. Here, first we are going to solve um, finding polynomial problem. So here, x and their corresponding y values will be given. Let us assume. Uh, these are the x values and these are the corresponding y values now first step is we need to make the finite difference table so let us build the difference table if you don't know how to build difference table you can see my other videos it is totally described there now let us build the finite difference table So six, six, and zero. So this is the finite difference table. Now, this table is the same table of this same problem. Now we are going to find the polynomial here. X equals to one. And h, h means the difference between consecutive x values. So here x values are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and each difference is 1. It is an equispace distribution and each difference is 1. Now let us uh, suppose a x. x means the any value in between this 1, 2, 5. So it can be expressed as x0 plus n into this difference just put the value of x0 and h and it will be x equals to 1 plus n so if we solve it then n will be equals to x minus 1 now we are going to find the polynomial i mean the polynomial is f of x so how to find this polynomial f of x just write down f of x and put the expression of x. What is the expression of x? x equals to x0 plus nh. Okay. Now, if it will be 1 plus del whole to the power n f of x0. It is described in my other videos how hmm, just see my uh, other tutorial video on uh, finite difference so it will be 1 plus del over to the power x minus 1 just put the value of n and n was x minus 1 now what we are going to do we are just going to uh, use the binomial theorem on this 1 plus del whole to the power x minus 1 in this term okay so using binomial theorem we get 1 plus x minus 1 into del plus plus x minus 1 uh, plus mm, okay it's problem in the camera Let's fix it up first okay plus x minus 1 x minus 2 by factorial 2 del square plus x minus 1 x minus 2 x minus 3 by factorial 3 into del q plus so on and, and then after that f of x0 this term x0 
okay <clears throat> now we just going to remove the bracket and then using distribution law f of x0 will be multiplied with each term so it will be f of x0 mm, x minus 1 del f of x0 x minus 1 into x minus 2 by factorial 2 del square f of x0 x minus 1 x minus 2 x minus 3 by factorial 3 del q of x0 plus other terms and these other all terms are 0 because after del cube x0 all the terms are 0 because del to the power 4 f of x0 is 0 del to the power 5 f of x0 is 0 and so on so these other terms will be 0 so we ignore this hmm. just see this finite openness table it is up to del cube f of x so we just take this terms up to del cube f of x0 so now we are just going to put the values so here we just put the values of f of x0 del f of x0 del square f of x0 all these terms now after solving we will get x is cube plus 2x plus 1 so it was the filing poly polynomial problem uh, and now we are going to solve the missing term problem so how to compute the missing terms here it is also a equispace distribution and all the x values will be given and all the y values will be given except one term so write down hmm. these are the x values 0 to 4 and y values will be given except one term so y values are 1 3 9 and let this term is missing we have to compute this this blank part so now we are going to build the difference table the approach is same build the difference table but we know we cannot compute the difference table if one term is missing so what we are going to do we are just take some value some uh, variable in this missing part so 9 and this term we just suppose there is uh, a okay just uh, there is no 5 uh, there is just uh, a we just this is this a is just a variable now unknown value and after computing this table we are just solving this value of a the procedure is same of computing the difference table the one more term minus 4 a yeah. okay so this is the final term and we are going to suppose this term will be 0 and after solving this equation we will get a equals to 31 so this is the missing term so this is a very easy problem i hope this video will help you subscribe us and like comment and share our video